वेलकम टू टेक केयर गाइस दिस इज सॉर्ड ऑफ यर एंड टुडे आई एम बैक विद द फुल रिव्यू ऑफ द सैनोजन मोड 13 द रीजन आई एम डूइंग दिस जस्ट आफ्टर वन डे इज बिकॉज देयर इज नथिंग न्यू अबाउट द सैनोजन मोड 13 दैट आई नीड टू शो बट देयर आर फ्यू बग्स इन दिस रोम दैट आई एम गोना शो यू फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट द गुड साइड्स और द नॉर्मल साइड्स वेल द रोम इज कंप्लीटली फ्लॉलेस द ट्रांजिशन इफेक्ट्स वर्क्स प्रीटी वेल and it's not rooted actually you have to root it by yourself use the twrp recovery and the you flash the super su that will do the trick for you well now guys there are four chinese apps which first of all are unnecessary and second of all i don't know what chinese means i mean i don't know the language anyways so we have to uninstall it so you know that uh, system uninstaller is there for us and you can only do uninstall them when you are rooted i mean your phone is rooted so Yes, uninstall them, and it's about to be get done. I just wanna show you how you can uninstall the system apps because a system uninstaller app is a pretty good one for you know uninstalling system uh, worthless system apps. So I mean, we'll be rebooting after uninstalling the system apps, and it's gonna take a bit of your time. So I'm back with uh, my phone. and overall guys uh, rebooting things booting up time everything is perfect but i will be telling you the cons later on but i will be showing you what the things are so guys the four chinese apps are gone thanks to system uninstaller and root privilege anyways guys uh, in case of the network and connectivity yes my geo 4g sim for indian users geo 4g sim if you are having one geo 4g sim it does work well And but there are a few problems that I will be telling you later on. Well, in the case of Geo 4G SIM, you can see. Well, it's asking for something that I don't want to give it right at the moment. Well, Geo 4G SIM it does work. Well, then internet also work. I I actually showed you that in my installing uh installation video or tutorial. So yes, uh for Geo users and for Geo users who are on Redmi 3S Prime, don't worry. This ROM will work. Work, but I would tell you, don't install the ROM right at the moment. Use uh, wait for a week or two. Uh, this ROM has bugs. In the case of display or lights, guys, uh, live display is there. Uh, the pretty good, the pretty normal feature for Cyanogen. All the features are there, and all the Cyanogen features really work perfectly. So I don't have to show you anything in very special. The notification light uh, is there. You can change their modes. You can do a lot of things. Theme center is there. You can install a lot of themes. Nothing wrong in there. No problems whatsoever. Pretty good one. But the problems that the reason I'm telling you not to uh, install this is uh, because of few problems that I will be telling you later on. But well, apart from that, all the other things are pretty damn good. And one good thing is that the fingerprint sensor does work. and yes that's a pretty good thing you can see i'm just uh, tapping it and yes it's unlocks and yes, it works like a charm we all know that xiaomi's fingerprint locks are pretty good well we get around 1.6 gigs free more or less all the time out of 3 gigs so that's pretty acceptable and yes you can add users like i said guys all the things that cm13 offers is present there in this phone or in this rom i'm i'm again telling you this i personally believe that this rom is still in the pre beta phase and the slider also works but uh somehow and few of the times it doesn't but that's completely acceptable i'm again telling you guys this rom might be still in the pre beta phase so there are a lot of bugs in here welcome to the first bug heating and battery draining like you know all that i hope like you all know that the more the heating the battery drains fast so yes uh, heating is prominent in there even in when i'm doing nothing with the phone i just unlock the phone and it starts heating up by itself 37 on the back 38 or 37 on the back is not what we expect even when i'm doing nothing with this one and 39 on the front is something i really hate to admit that this rom sucks this rom really sucks in case of the heating and that actually uh, i'm i actually haven't even charged the phone from the very last boot because i'm afraid that my phone might blast and yes for geo users well geo net is all working but calling is not working i'm trying to call myself my phone number well and it's not working 
like it literally is not it freezes up i don't know what happens but it does not work well the third uh, well the geo 4g voice is not working and it's a very big down let down no not your geo join app is wo- working nothing is working about geo the bug number three and it is the se- most severe one is that you can shoot a video but you can't save it okay i'm showing you that well i'm just recording a video you can see it here and well just uh, just stopped it and you can see well the video is not there you can shoot a video but you can't save it uh, it's still a bug and i believe it will be resolved in the uh, more uh, future updates and well i'm clicking a picture and it will work and you can see it's been saved but videos are not working well that happened with uh well now use a new app i hope that it might get solved no 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 it's not gonna get solved <laughs> i'm shooting at 1080p guys the video is re- being recorded here Ta-da! well stop it well saving failed great 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 but yes uh, i i promise you that i know it's not my promise developers have promised that they are gonna solve it very soon and you can even stop recording and you can't even save and actually the wh- whole video recording portion is you know freezing while doing the work so that's a pretty bad thing pretty pretty bad thing i mean it's the first time i'm uh, seeing such kind of thing that video is shooting but you can't save it well overall guys yes for normal usages the phone might be the rom might be okay but the, the heating actually is not appreciable and i'm not appreciating the heating so yes well again run a video it's our video and the vi- link of this video will be in the description make sure to check that and one thing i want to show you is that you can't use the hardware decoder in mx player well that's another bug of this rom it can't utilize the hardware decoder anyways we have to rely on the software decoder otherwise more or less all the things are pretty okay these are the four bugs that i want to tell you and well to be speaking to you honestly i really didn't like it i would recommend you not to install this rom as of now when the right time comes i will do a separate video and will let you tell you that download the rom so guys like this video if you want dislike if you want do subscribe to our channel we have a great day bye bye now